welcome back to my YouTube channel and if you guys are new here, hi, nice to meet you, welcome. And for today's video, we are going to compare kung anong mas maganda kung si Lux Organics Ultimate Defense Tinted Sunscreen, here you go, or si Sun Glow by Fresh Cream Tinted Sunscreen. There you go. Alright, so I did a little bit of shopping sa Watsons online, by the way, kasi, um, alam niyo naman, medyo delikado pang lumabas. At kailangan natin sundan si Kim Chu kapag sinabi niyang bawal lumabas o oh, bawal lumabas. Eh! 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 What did you do? Why did you do it? Why did you do it? Why? Anyway, um, I would also like to put out na, I'm so, I'm so sorry if I will be looking at this thing every every so often. Um, medyo magbuhan pa ang ating girl niya sa YouTube at medyo awkward pa on camera, so please bear with me sa ngayon, alright? Also, I just realized na sinulat ko yung guide ko sa prescription pad ng mom ko. She's gonna kill me! <laughs> okay, sige na, sige na, sige na. So, nag-shopping ako sa Watsons and I bought these two along with a few other products that I will be showing you guys later on. Binili ko si Fresh kasi maraming positive reviews tungkol dito. Ito si Lux Organics, binili ko din siya kasi maraming nagsasabi na mas better daw itong si Fresh kaysa kay, um, kay Lux Organics. And um, I wanted to do a comparison kung totoo nga ba yung sinasabi nila. Also, some people had a few things to say about Lux Organics, yung tinted sunscreen nila. Some people have said na it's ashy, na mabigat sa face, at saka mainit sa face, at saka maputi sa face. I've also heard na they cater to the lighter skin tones. Na parang shade range who ang tag nila. Um, so, nag-research ako ng pictures ng shades nila on the internet. I'm gonna show, I'm gonna show you the photo right now. And pagdating sa shade range, oo nga, parang, parang mas um, bagay sila sa mga taong may lighter skin tones. But, ang tanong, totoo ba yung sinasabi nila na ashy, masyadong maputi sa face, mainit at mabigat sa face? Mamaya malalaman natin yan. Alright guys, so I'm going to give you a little bit of a background tungkol kay Sun Glow by Fresh. So Sun Glow by Fresh is a new physical sunscreen line in the Philippine market. So medyo bago-bago pa siya sa um, market natin dito. And um, kahit bago pa siya, yung Fresh in general, marami ng magandang reviews about the brand itself. Um, they are also considered very effective sa pagpo-protect sa skin um, against the ay sorry sa pagpo-protect ng skin mo from the harmful UVA and UVB rays of the sun. So um, actually they come in three different they also come in three different shades. Meron silang fair, medium, and deep. In my case, I got medium kasi parang ito yung malapit-lapit sa skin tone ko. And um, upon looking at their shades, I'm going to flash a photo of um, yung complete shade range neto. Alright guys, so yun ang mga claims ni Fresh so far. And um, later on, i-explain ko yung differences between um, a physical sunscreen and a chemical sunscreen. O nga pala guys, I forgot a very important point. Very safe siya gamitin para sa breastfeeding and lactating moms. So sa so mga soon-to-be mommies dyan, at saka sa mga um, new mommies, safe na safe ito sa inyo. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is we're going to compare these two right here on my arm. So, una, unahin muna nating iswatch itong si Lux Organics. Okay. I'm gonna put it right here on my finger. Ayan. Ayun. So, as you can see, dito pa lang ang puti na niya, guys. Oh. Okay? So, swatch naman natin itong si Fresh. By the way, it's in the shade Medium. At, it, at itong si Lux ay in the shade Natural. Right. I would also like to point out na itong si um, Lux ay... Disqueeze siya. Tapos pagkabukas ko kanina, medyo parang natapon na. Tapos itong si Fresh parang pump. Eh, a, lot have, a lot have been saying na parang mas better itong si Fresh kasi um, may pagka-spill proof siya since ano, it comes in a pump form. So yeah. 
I'm very particular pagdating sa ganun because I always travel and I always like to have travel handy items with me. Okay, so is watch naman natin si Sun Glow by Fresh in medium. Ayan. So kita nyo na yung difference niya. Ito ngayon pa lang masasabi ko na um, I think bagay sa akin itong ano si Fresh, yung shade niya na medium. So mamaya um itatry ko siya sa face ko. Um, kung mapapansin nyo guys, ano, um, kilay lang at saka eye makeup lang ang, ano, ang in-apply ko kanina nung nag-makeup ako. Para ipakita ko sa inyo, I really want to try it in front of you guys. If, um, fresh, if fre Sun Glow by Fresh's Tinted Sunscreen will really match my skin tone. Ayun, so mamaya, um, try ko sa tapat, sa tapat nyo. If mag-work sa akin yung... Sorry guys, <laughs> medyo nadalos ako dito. Um, yung, if mag-work sa akin, yung um, shade na medium from Fresh. And actually, um, tinry ko na si Lux Organics a few days ago. And guys, oh god, ang puti niya sa face ko, promise. I'm gonna roll a clip. Ayun, so kung mapapansin nyo sa video, parang it's like two shades lighter than my skin tone. And also, um, it feels really uncomfortable on the skin. It's heavy and um, mainit yung feeling sa, ano, sa, sa skin mo. Parang nagsusuot ka ng, make, ng foundation na parang super kapal ng consistency niya and stuff like that. So, sabi pa nga dito sa packaging ng... Um, Lux na it's lightweight pero parang hindi totoo pero parang hindi totoo kasi nabiyon nga nabigat, nabigatan ako nung um nung tinry ko siya sa face ko also when i applied it um it feels kind of sticky on the skin it really gave me an uncomfortable feeling hindi ko siya natiis tinanggal ko siya kaagad sa face ko guys so eto na ito try na natin si fresh i am just going to tie my hair up so that it doesn't get in the way Okay, first things first is primer, and ang gagamitin ko na primer is um, one of the other products that I bought, which is Sun Glow by Fresh na Sun Mist. Ayan. Actually guys, lalabas ako mamaya. I have an important errand to run, kaya tamang-tama na film din ako neto. Aba? In fairness guys, ha? Aba, sakto. Ang galing. Ang galing. Parang hindi ako naka-foundation. Or basta any base makeup. Also, um, it's very lightweight now that I'm applying it. And it's really easy to apply. It's not greasy. In fairness, ha? Huh? Sumakto. Ang galing. I love it so far. Guys, try natin sa ibang light, ha? Ayan, in fairness, ang ganda. O Oo nga talaga, guys. Anong ko pa ulit-ulit ko na tong sinasabi. Pero parang wala nga akong foundation. Saktong-sakto siya. Ang galing. Also, nung ina-apply ko siya, ang dali lang. Hindi siya greasy. Hindi siya makalat. Parang... It glides onto your skin. And when you say na effective ang isang sunscreen or tinted sunscreen, usually ang iniisip ng marami is mabigat siya sa face. Ito hindi. Parang okay. Parang okay siya. Tapos actually ha, um, kaya medyo maganda yung lighting ngayon kasi nakabukas yung, ano, yung bintana dito. Tapos um, may sunlight. So medyo tutok ako sa araw. Kaya ayun, sinadya ako talaga. Will this protect me? Let's see. Hey guys, I'm going to finish with the rest of my makeup and I'll catch you, um, I'll catch up with you guys in a minute.
Ayun guys, nakakatuwa talaga siya. Oh. Sumakto talaga siya sa skin ko. Really can't get over the fact na parang hindi ako naka-base makeup when in fact meron talaga. So, ayun. Fresh honey, you did a good job. I like it. <laughs> okay guys, ngayon i-discuss naman natin ang shade range ni Lux Organics sa, sa, sa tinted sunscreens nila and yung shade range ni Sun Glow by Fresh tinted sunscreens. Alright, una sa lahat, um, for me, nadi-disappoint ako sa shade range ni Lux Organics kasi, they, first of all, they seem to be, to cater to the lighter skin tones and um, it seems to me like they did not have the Filipino skin tone in mind when they formulated their sunscreens. Don't get me wrong, I'm very much aware na maraming mga Filipinos doon that have naturally lighter complexions. Pero meron ding mga tulad ko na moreno at morena. At meron ding mga tao na mas darker pa yung complexion kaysa sa akin. What I also did not like sa... Um, Lux Organics Tinted Sunscreen is um, ang ashy ng finish niya sa face ko. Kita niyo naman sa video kanina at saka sa picture. Tapos kita niyo naman, either way, it did not look good. Parang yun nga, like what I said like what I said kanina, parang two baka nga three shades lighter pa nga siya sa skin tone ko. Pero natural na yung pangalan ng shade na yun. Also, um Mukhang, nag, mukhang totoong sinasabi nila kasi na-experience na ko na din mismo. I tried um, the sunscreen naman talaga kasi first hand so that I could give my honest opinion on it. Na ang bigat nga niya sa face at saka ang init niya sa face. Sa totoo lang guys, I felt so uncomfortable with it. Tinanggal ko siya kaagad. Si Fresh, on the other hand, nakakatuwa kasi nung... Siguro nung finormulate nila yung sunscreens nila, nung minanufacture nila, talagang inisip nila ang Filipino skin tones at saka mukhang ano, in-address din nila ang concerns ng Filipino skin. Itong si Fresh, very lightweight siya sa skin. Ang dali niya lang i-apply. It's not greasy and it's as if ano, yung itsura niya, kita niya naman, like I said kanina, parang hindi ako naka, parang hindi ako naka base makeup. Pero, um, and also, pala, hindi pero, and also, parang feeling mo din, dahil sa sobrang lightweight niya, parang feeling mo parang wala ka talagang suot na base makeup as well. Lightweight products are very, you know, important to, you know, us Filipinos since um, mainit dito sa Pilipinas and using, you know, products that have like a heavy kind of consistency tapos, tum tapos uh, no, lumabas ka doon sa initan, it can really take a toll on our skin. You can break out, it can cause, you know, certain damages to your skin which is of course not good naman talaga. Alright guys, so right now, i-discuss naman natin ang benefits ng sunscreen and the difference between physical and chemical sunscreens. So, ano nga ba yung benefits ng sunscreen? So, um, sunscreen is known to be a very essential skincare product. I do believe that everyone must own a sunscreen. And, um, ang ginagawa niya, it protects your skin um, from the damages that the UV rays can do to it. And also, meron siyang anti-aging benefits. So, so, ayun, it can protect you from sunburn, from discoloration, and stuff like that. Yun, maraming um, benefits si sunscreen. La and, I do believe, and I do believe that it's very important, lalo na for us who are living in tropical countries, like, um, you know, here in the Philippines. So I recently have learned that uh, there are two types of sunscreens. We have the mineral, and we have mineral or physical, and we have the chemical sunscreen. So uh, keep in mind that this si Lux Organics is a chemical sunscreen, and this one si Fresh is a physical slash mineral sunscreen. What are the differences? Let's isa natin. So, chemical sunscreens have organic and carbon-based chemical compounds. They absorb UV rays and convert um, to heat which is released through the skin. Also, chemical sunscreens are easily absorbed by the skin. Um, it kind of makes sense now because um, yun nga, si Lux a chemical sunscreen. Tapos, um, as per stated here, um, they absorb UV rays 
and um, they generate heat through the skin. Kaya palang init niya sa face ko. Tapos, um, inaabsorb siya easily by the skin, which explains the heavy feeling that I felt nung natry ko siya. Okay, so ano naman ang physical sunscreens? Physical sunscreens or mineral sunscreens, on the contrary, contain zinc oxide and titanium oxide, which are active mineral ingredients. So, itong mga minerals na to, they create a barrier or harang sa skin mo para mabablock niya talaga ang UV rays. Um, hindi sila inaabsorb ng skin. They just sit on top of the skin surface. So, basically, um, guaranteed protection na talaga siya. I'd also like to make it clear na noong tinry ko yung sunscreen ni Lux, hindi ako lumabas ng bahay at gabi nun. Pero, I still felt... Um, the heavy feeling on my face, probably because um, yun nga, ang daling yung ano, ma-absorb ng skin ko. Tapos mainit kasi nun, kaya siguro, which explains the um, the, you know, the hot sensation on my face. So, ayun guys ha, hindi ako lumabas sa lagay na yan. Paano na kaya yung feeling ng um, ng pagiging mainit at mabigat sa face pag lumabas na kaya ako at maaraw? It would certainly feel uncomfortable and madadamage ang skin ko for sure. So as per, for my personal verdict, itong si Fresh ang panalo para sa akin. Um, for me, mas prefer ko si Fresh kasi una sa lahat, malaking factor for me yung talagang inisip nila yung Filipino skin tones nung um, finormulate nila ang products nila. And inisip din nila yung concerns ng mga, ng, ang skincare concerns ng mga Pinoy. So, um, as I mentioned kanina, maganda yung shade range niya. Um, fit na fit sa akin as um, for someone who is a morena. Tapos, um, lightweight siya, hindi siya greasy, and ang dali-dali niyang i-apply. And it looks, it gives a really natural finish. Si Lux Organics naman, on the other hand, ang sabi dito sa packaging niya, um, lightweight daw siya, has a smooth finish, and no white cast. Um, I certainly do not believe in this. I'm so sorry, kasi, um... Sinabi nilang lightweight, it felt heavy on my skin. I know I, kept, I keep on saying that, pero ang bigat talaga sa face ko. Smooth finish, I disagree kasi um, when I, when I um, applied it on my skin, I, hindi ko yata nasabi sa inyo kanina guys, pero um, it's not that easy to apply. And no white cast, pero ang puti niya sa face ko. So... I'm so sorry, Lux Organics. Um, you you definitely did not work for me this time. So ngayon, ibibigay ko ang Corona Kai Fresh. Natutuwa talaga ako sa kanya because um in terms of the shade range and the fact that it's very lightweight on the skin. And I know I keep repeating myself pagdating sa ganyang factor, pero um shade range and um consistency is a very important factor for me. Dito sa Philippine market, it's kinda hard, sa cosmetic market specifically, it's kinda hard for me to, um, when it comes to base makeup, to find the right shade for my skin tone because I'm a morena. And napapansin ko, both, pagdating sa both um, local and foreign brands that are sold here in the Philippines, uh, nahihirapan ako maghanap ng shade na sakto para sa akin. Pagdating sa concealer, um, Hindi ako gaano nahirapan. I can still I still find the perfect shade for me here in the Philippines. Pero pagdating sa um, powder at saka sa foundation, lalo na sa foundation, nahihirapan talaga ako. When I traveled to Europe a few times before, napapansin ko sa kanya kapag minsan pumupunta ako sa mga drug stores nila or basta mga stores nila that sell makeup, napapansin ko sobrang wide ng shade range nila. Parang lahat yata ng skin tones um, they have a shade, they have, it's like, it's like they have a shade for every skin tone. So, ano, natuwa ako, and ironically, dun sa ibang bansa, dun ko lang nakita ang, ang shade na sakto para sa akin. So, since then, I made it a point na every time na pupunta ako sa Europe, pupunta ako sa Australia, um, uh, mag-hoard na talaga ako ng base makeup dun. Eh ngayon, mukhang hindi ko na kailangan lumayo, mukhang hindi ko na kailangan lumipad sa ibang bansa kasi andito na si Fresh. Fresh is such a game changer pagdating dito sa sunscreen, sa tinted sunscreen nila kasi 
sumakto siya sa shade ko. Right guys, so compare naman natin ang prices ng dalawang sunscreens. So itong si Lux Organics, teka magkano siya? <laughs> Sorry, di ko memorize yung presyo. Uh, 349 pesos itong si Lux, tas itong si Fresh ay 429 pesos. So, as you can see, um, Fresh is 80 pesos more expensive compared kay Lux. But if you ask me, it's worth it to spend 80 pesos more dito kay Fresh. Because kay Fresh, guaranteed na you will be really prote be protected from the sun. Maganda yung shade range niya. It's very lightweight on the skin and you feel, pagka-apply mo, you feel as if wala ka talagang suot. So, um, ayan. So, equally lightweight and effective product, I say, you guys have to go for fresh. Guys, pakita ko sa inyo yung mga ibang products na binili ko sa Watsons. I'm sure nakita niyo na kanina habang, um, habang tinatapos ko yung makeup ko kanina after I applied the, sun, the fresh sunscreen. So, binili ko din ang kanilang sun mist. The best results, you, you have to use this when, ano, um, you have to use this with the, sun, the, with the tinted sunscreen. Also, bumili din ako ng tinted lip screen nila. Yan. Tatlo sila. Atong shade sila ay very berry, sun kissed, and sangria. So, kanina, ginamit ko si sangria sa lips ko. Ginawa ko siyang lip tint. Tapos, ano, cheek tint din. Hindi lang masyadong halata kasi konti lang yung nilagay ko. But, it's very easy to apply. It, um, it glides very well on the cheeks. And, yeah, I see myself um, using these lip screens um, more often in the future. And, actually, next to the sunscreen, ito yung, ito yung favorite ko. Yung Set and Fix Mattifying Sunscreen Powder. Um, nung tinry ko siya kanina, maganda din ang finish niya sa face ko. Konti lang ang nilagay ko. I don't wanna go overboard pagdating sa powder. And kung titingnan niyo siya, yan, white siya. Pero don't be deceived. Kasi kahit puti siya, tapos ako ay morena. Nung nilagay ko, uh, natural pa din ang finish niya sa face ko. Also, this is very lightweight. Parang feeling mo talaga, ganun din, tulad ng sunscreen, parang wala ka talaga suot na makeup. Okay, so now we have reached the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you loved my review and my comparison on um, Lux Organic Sustented Sunscreens versus Fresh Sun Glow by Fresh Sustented Sunscreens. All right, so um, if you like this video, do not forget to leave a like and do not forget to leave a comment as well. And also do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much guys for watching. Hope to see you guys in my next video. Always stay safe and healthy and goodbye!